The U.S. dollar is seeing broad-based gains in midweek trade. This morning's ADP figures show that employment in the private sector in the U.S. soared by 298,000 in February. The figure was well above the estimates, calling for a gain above, of 190,000. Now, there is an anticipation ahead of Friday's jobs report and next week's Fed meeting. Meanwhile, the euro currency dipped to a five-day low against the dollar. Thursday brings the ECB rate decision, which will be closely watched for details on the central bank's outlook. Now, there is the possibility that ECB President Mario Draghi could tweak some of the language to prepare for a winding back of the stimulus program. Now, in New York morning trade, euro dollar is down 0.15% at 1.0550. The British pound against the U.S. currency is off 0.2% at 1.2173, while dollar yen is up half a percent at 1.14.57. The New Zealand dollar against the U.S. currency is in focus today. That pair is bearish and trading into a declining channel. Now, the RSI is mixed to bearish, and trading central analysts prefer short positions below 0.6990 with targets at 0.6920 and 68.90 in extension. In precious metals, gold and silver futures are bearish. Now, gold is capped by a bearish trend line, and trading central analysts prefer short positions below the resistance at 1218.50. Targets currently stand at 1208 and 1205 in extension. Meanwhile, silver futures are off 1% in New York morning trade at $17.36 per troy ounce. That does wrap it up for this morning. I'm Remy Blair reporting from the New York Stock Exchange. Make sure to follow us on Twitter at Trading Central. Have a great day.